Welcome back to my channel. I just want to get out here real quick and just show you the little setup you've heard in my last couple videos that I've been talking about how I had a little craft area set up with my husband brought up a desk we had downstairs and I kind of took over part of the living room. It might be a little more crowded in the living room, but so what? This is our home. We're all closed, so it's okay. So this is the desk he brought up. Let me try back up a little bit. This is the desk he brought up for me. And I cool, ignore my cord down there because I have to have that to plug in my lamp, little lamp there and so I could be able to plug in my glue gun. So this is the desk here. On the desk, well, these are scrap, little scrap papers I cut from this pocket letter I'm working on. You see, I'm not sending them up, but I am working on pocket letters and getting them made. This is what I made with them. The pandas from the Lisa Frank um, 2016 calendar I cut out. Still working, got to work on the back. Just barely started on that, but got that over here. I got my planner and I got my Bible. And I brought this little lamp and this little pretty glittery flower right here is from Trisha, mom of two boys. She gave it to me with the awesome Christmas pocket letter she sent me. And then this card, because I think it's so beautiful, so I can get a frame for it. I'm just sitting in here is from Audra the other day from the friend mail she sent me and this is my caramel candle that's all I got left that right there and this is just a cup I keep some of my pencils and my scissors and my magnifying glass if I need it and then this is some of the washies I'm using for this pocket letter I'm working on and this is my little heart hole punch so it punches little hearts in there and this is from Crystal at Purple Glitter Kisses from the friend mail she sent me. I know it's not Christmas time, but Jesus is the reason for the season all the time, all year long. And then over here I just got some books that I want to be reading. My stapler, nor the paper towels. And then this is from the friend mail from Leah yesterday, the journal she sent me with the Lord's Prayer on the front. And these are from, I was, the other day we had a few extra dollars, so I was able to pick up a few things at Dollar Tree, and I'm going to be working on this Valentine ATC um, card that Leah at uh, My Day-to-Day -day Life is doing, like a little contest. So I got some Valentine ribbon. I'm going to use this, though, to make paper clips. And I was able to get some of the little heart gems and these cute little stickers and then these stickers right here I don't know yet what I'm doing but that's you know that's part of it I want to try to get a couple more if I can this box here is a box from when Leah sent me the friend mail and it's perfect size for the washi I have because I don't have a huge collection but this here and one just jumped out of here and ran away somewhere I will find it later um, this here is my washi tape this is the ones from friend mails that people sent me on the top here. I'm trying to do this with one hand, guys. <laughs> um, and then here, this is just my washi. Over here, I got my, my few little thin washies I have. And, and then there's like just one more little layer down there of some washies. You know. So this is it. This is all I got. Not no huge collection. I, I long to have a collection like some of you because I love washi, but just don't, can't do it right now. So anyway, well, I'll close that later. So over here, I got a little cart with a bunch of different drawers. Ignore the front. My kids drew on this because this originally was in their room for them to store stuff and everything kept coming out of here and they never put it back. So I took it from them to use for my craft stuff. Up on the top here, I got... Until I could find somewhere to hang it in here, in here, Liz, I got your your um, friendship as one of life's greatest treasures that you sent me in the ornament exchange from the um, planner collab. So got to find somewhere to hang that. And then I got this little thing that turns around, and it's got all these scissors. See where you can cut different um, different designs in the paper. Let me turn around. See, it shows you the right there the different designs that you can make. And then they all have a name on them. They like that, but they all have different designs on them. And this is where I keep my ribbons that I use to make paper clips and whatever else I might use them for. I gotta work on making some more paper clips. Then I got the small ribbons here that Corey sent me. Thank you. I gotta make some more paper clips for those. And then I just have a little cup here and a little bowl here with paper clips. These are the ones that I've been using, like in my planner, each week. 
And then this is my cute little guy I got at Christmas time at Dollar Tree. He's so adorable. I just had to get him and he sits there. So in my top drawer here is a mess, but it's basically just pens, um, refill for my for my tape runner here. Um, this is some double-sided tape. Um, this is where I got the band-aids in here that people have sent me and pocket letters right here. Um, I got glue sticks in here. But it's not nothing exciting in the first place. The second drawer is, this is where I had my washi, but I took it and put it in this box because it was perfect for just the washi I got right now. So in here I got like these little bags of all the like little embellishments that people have sent me and pocket letters. And then these are the awesome paper clips Leah sent me yesterday. Then here I have a, what's called a, I don't know if it's Sizzix. I think it's a Sizzix machine, but it's a very old one. I want to get the newer kind, but it, it does its job. And these are just some cutouts I made with it. These are some roses. And what do we got here? Some candy canes that I made at Christmas time. And then some just like little candy pieces. And then here's some hearts, just different size with different paper. And then these are just some loose stickers. Um, and then some stars. We got different sizes. And then we got these tags. I used different paper and made different size. They have different size tags. And then over here we got ice cream cones that I made. You know, with different colored paper. So that's what I, that's what we got there. And then over here, I got my, my one and only punch that punches designs. This one, this is it. I hope to someday be able to get a lot more punches, but this is my only punch for now. And then these are the corner rounders. This does the half inch. This does the one inch. I got these at Target. They were like $10 for the two of them. So... They work, they do their job. And these are what I use when I make my little notebooks to make the little bands to hold and close. And then these are the keep it together bands, you know, for my planner. I'm knocking stuff down, guys. I'm knocking stuff down. Okay, and then in this drawer, I got some ink pads for some stamps when I get to my card making here. And then just these little embellishments, some more stamps to get on bit of tape and then these are stamped from the dollar spot at Target and then this next drawer well this bag you see here this is all filled with paper clips paper clips paper clips all different kinds of bags of paper clips that I've made over here it's ready to go in pocket letters when I'm start starting also Debbie Debbie Oopsie you're watching I'm gonna be picking some of these out of here you told me Hello Kitty and, and your planner is pink, so I'll be picking some of these out to send to you. And then I got just um, this is just some of them using my empty medicine bottles to um, hold. These are like the butterfly embellishments I use for my paper clips and the flower and the heart ones. And then just some stickers. These I'm saving to use on cards and, you know, a little bit of bling that I do got and some more stickers. I'm on a better way to organize my stickers because this is how my stickers are right now. When I want stickers, I just kind of dig through here. <laughs> and then what do we got down here? Oh, down here I got all my paper clips for bags by different sizes. And if they're neon or just plain colored. And there's some embellishments. And then what do we got down here? Oh, down here we got, um, these are some envelopes that I made. I um, downloaded from the computer like different patterns so you can make your own homemade envelopes. And like I made this one here, this one here I made, um, and this one here that opens up on the top right here, Ooh, opens up like this, so I got that one, and then these here I just made basically a similar envelope, but just different sizes, like these are some really small ones, these are a little bit bigger. And then these are even bigger than those. So and I figured these I want to use for like in pocket letters and I could put little things inside of them. So I got those. And these are just pictures and quotes and sayings I cut out of magazines to use. And just my cardstock, different pinks and purples. And down here, oh, this is another pocket letter that I was working on. That, you know, it's like a faith based one that I'm working on here. Still got to do something with the back. 
And then it's just my pockets and my pocket letters, my Christian stickers, and then more paper, orange and yellows. And then down here, I think we got more paper, they have the blues and just some little journal cards and things. And we come over on this side, we got the things that go in the Sizzix machine. This is the hearts. What do I got? I didn't, haven't made any of these yet. It's like the, you know, the movie reel stuff. Um, this is the candy one. We got this one for Christmas time. The stockings, the light, and an ornament. Let's see, we got ice cream cone. Let's see, that's some light and ornaments there. And then there's the rose one. And then the candy cane one. So underneath this one. And then we got there's the heart one that cuts out four different size hearts. And then this one's like a 4th of July, like a fire a firework one. And then there's the star one. And then this one's like a you know badge, like an award one. And then that one down there is shaped like a pocket. But these are all of the very old Sizzix machine that I have under, nor the carpet, it needs to be vacuumed, down there, down there, that I use. And then under here is all my, the stamps that I have. And then in that green bag is all my women's Bible study books that I have that I got to go through. <laughs> then we brought this up here, and it basically holds my Bibles and different books, a couple different books, and of course, the pictures of the kids. But then this here opens up. This actually used to be an old, like, wine cart. You could, oh, it opens up on the top and, like, hold bottles of wines and stuff. But I'm using it for storage. I got my, um, some paper stock down here. Um, then over there is, like, scrap papers and stuff that I hold on to in case I need just a certain size little piece of paper. And that's in there. So that is my, my whole little craft area. And nothing great exciting, but just thought I'd show you guys because some, some of you asked that I should show, you know, ask for me to film and show my craft area once I get it set up. So there it is. And I'm going to planning on, I was planning on doing some sitting down and crafting today and I have not got to any between washing clothes and then I'm trying to, I want to answer because I like to answer, um, answer the, the, everybody's comments on YouTube and for those of you if you see that I answer other people's comments and you see that I have not answered yours the only reason is because for whatever reason and I know a lot of you know this is going on with YouTube for whatever reason I, I type up the answer and when I go to hit reply it will not it will not put the, the reply so it's not that I'm ignoring you and I don't want to answer you it's just for whatever reason and y'all know that it's going on because I'm not the only one it's happening to that for whatever reason is not answering. You know, I go to the the spam thing and I approve everybody's comments that it moved over there for whatever reason. And but then it won't let me comment on some people. Now I was trying to comment this morning. Some days I can come I can reply to those people's comments, other days I can't reply to their comments. So I I don't know what's going on. Whatever YouTube is up to. But I'm going to work on some more of these envelopes for sure. I want to work on pocket letters. Definitely pocket letters and get them done. Because I, when I'm in around the middle of February, when I'm able to start sending them out, I want to have them all ready to go and just mail them all out to everybody. Well, I guess I'll go now so I can maybe try to get something done. You know, I just got like about an hour or 40 minutes, so I got to get myself together to go and get the kids from school. So I hope you all... Have a most wonderful, blessed day, and I will talk to everybody really, really soon. Bye-bye.